All right guys, Rich here from the RC Network, and in this video, I'm gonna show you a new body from ProLineRacing.com. This is their new Chevy Silverado body intended for the Axial SCX-10 trail honcho. Now, ProLine released a F-250 body uh, about, uh, about a year ago or so uh, for the trail honcho, and of course, they need to take care of those Chevy fans as well. So of course, the Chevy Silverado body has now been released, and I picked this thing up directly from ProLineRacing.com, and I wanted to see what it was all about. I saw some uh, release photos of it, and I definitely liked it, although I am a Ford guy. So let's go ahead and take a look at what you get inside the package. Towards the end of this video, I'm actually gonna show you guys what it looks like painted and mounted up to a trail honcho. So um, first off, here is the look of the card it comes on. Um, of course, this is an, a officially licensed uh, body from General Motors, so it has all the trademarks and um, it is under license to ProLine Racing. Uh, right here, it is intended for the 12.3 inch wheelbase, so keep that in mind if you are mounting this up to uh, your uh, trail honcho or if you just have an SEX10, make sure you do have the 12.3 inch wheelbase. Now, of course, the Dingo and a couple others have an 11.2, I believe, uh, inch wheelbase, so keep that in mind. Um, now, once again, this is officially licensed, has all of the cool features of the Chevy Silverado, and I can't wait to get this thing painted and mounted up. But let's take a look at some of the other things on this. Let's take a look at the body really quick. Uh, this thing is super cool. I, I, I really liked it when I unpackaged this thing. Uh, the biggest thing is the huge hood and grill section that is just, you know, known on Chevy Silverado. So huge front bumper here has the bow tie badging, the large uh, kind of scooped hood right there. Definitely like that. Huge wheel flares. You can kind of see how much that sticks out a good three eighths of an inch from the regular body. So you're gonna be able to fit some pretty good sized tires um, into that. Definitely 1.9s with no issue, possibly some 2.2s. Um, on back here, you do get the double door. Not sure if this is a full, um, dual cab but it definitely looks um, uh, longer so back here to the back you do have the kind of gusseted or the corrugated bed features really nice detail there they didn't have to do that but they did uh, third brake light up here um, just really really nice you do get uh, um, all of the handle indents right there and I'll show you guys on the sticker sheet um, what you get as well but um, once again, the wheel flares, just super cool. What I really like about these honcho bodies is they're small, easy to paint up, easy to cut out, and you know, pretty much you're, you're set to go after that. It has a protective film on the outside. You do spray these from the inside, being a polycarbonate or Lexan shell. And there you go. So let's go ahead and take a look at some of the supplement items that you get in the package. Right here you get uh, a little information booklet from ProLine Racing with some of their other items they have available, some cool performance items, of course tires and bodies and everything else. And on the back side here, Protoform, their sister company for the on-road folks. Um, right here you do have uh, window masks or window decals to um, give you that extra scale look of actual windows. Uh, rear, front, and you got doubles on the sides. And last, I think this is what we all wait for, is a good sticker sheet. So uh, we have all of the officially licensed Chevy items, the whole front grille, the front hood uh, kind of emblem there, all the bottom section of the front grille, uh, fog lights, you have the two side marker lights, the rear third tail light, handles like I told you earlier. Um, other cool thing is they give you lots of Proline, of course, but they give you three different versions of bow ties. You get the black, the white, and two huge silver ones there. Also the large white Silverado um, badging and then also the little side ones that are kind of black and silver. So really cool that they gave you all this stuff. And they actually even have some directions on here on how to get the curvature of uh, getting over the top of the lights. So uh, really nice, I, I dig sticker sheets and uh, that definitely helps. Well, I'm gonna get busy painting this thing up and I'll show you guys what it looks like in the end. All right, we're back now. We went ahead and got this thing painted up. I uh, went with just a basic sprint white and 
I, it actually turned out pretty decent with the uh, way that the honcho actually sits and everything. Uh, added some Proline decals, of course, and all of the Silverado decals as well. Um, the decal sheet on this thing is pretty much what we pay for to get this thing looking as scale as it does. Now, of course, with Proline, you get top of the line everything is when it comes to the uh, thickness of the Lexan. I know that there were some issues way back when with the thickness of the rear cab section here. This one actually worked out pretty well. Uh, very thick all the way around and in the end just a great body. Now keep in mind if you do plan to mount this up to your honcho there's quite a bit of overhang here for the front and actually you'll see my bumpers actually inside um, kind of behind the facade bumper here on the Lexan. So, but in the end, we are looking for the scale looks of this thing, and it looks damn good. I'm gonna go ahead and bring this thing a little bit closer here. I uh, kind of see the scale look of the uh, the front uh, grill. Of course, the Chevy bow tie. Got the uh, little xenon headlights right there. Tons of extra lights and fog lights and the lower grill assembly right there. On over here, we got the little Silverado sticker, uh, the decals for, of course, the handles, and just looks damn good. You'll see here the body pins are actually way up here, all the way by the front uh, um, windshield. So, But that is it. That is the kind of unveil here for the Proline Silverado body for the SEX 10 Honcho. If you have any questions about this video, please post those on down below. And as always, thumbs up and subscribe. That's it for now, guys. Over and out.